Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. Windows 10 version 21H1, also known as the Windows 10 May 2021 feature update, is now being made more widely available according to Microsoft Worldwide and is being offered to more users if you go and manually check for your updates in Windows Update. And this is, of course, if you have not received the update previously. And as many of you know, 21H1 was the first feature update that started rolling out for Windows 10 this year. Now, 21H1 started rolling out on the 18th of May, and initially it started rolling out, you know, quite slowly and wasn't made available to all um, initially. Now, 21H1 is um, offered to you if you are running the May 2020 update, which is version 2004, and the October 2020 update, which is version 20H2. Now, according to Microsoft, they say that the number of devices which are being offered um, 21H1 has been increased in this month of June 2021. So we are already on the 5th of June. So that means that, you know, hopefully later on in the month, um, more, if you haven't got it ready, it will be made ma more available as the month progresses. Now, as always, if you want to check if you have the update, if you haven't received it already, just head over to your settings, update and security. And what you will have to do, because it's not an automatic update, it's an optional update. So what, what you'll have to do is actually seek for it and go and check for updates. And, you know, if it's available for your device, what will happen? It will appear under optional updates. And then what you have to do is you just download and install. And then you would have to restart your device after the update to apply the update and upgrade to version 21H1. Now, according to Microsoft in um, a latest report, they say that they are now using machine learning and artificial intelligence methods to automatically upgrade devices running version 2004 and 20H2 to version 21H1. And I did make a video a while back um, on this uh, topic previously. Now, if you go to view update history, obviously, if you have the update, this won't apply uh, to you what I'm mentioning in this video today. This is only for those of you who have not been able to receive the update as yet and that's because due to diagnostic feedback you know um, Microsoft obviously hasn't pushed it out to your machine for a number of reasons but as I mentioned you know the artificial intelligence methods are now being deployed to automatically upgrade your device um, you know when you go and check for updates obviously because it's an optional update and if you still don't see the update for whatever reason um, just be patient because I'm sure you will get it in the next couple of days or weeks and as mentioned previously also on this channel for whatever reason if you really want the update and you know you, you you you're not seeing it when you check for updates you can go to the media creation tool or the windows update assistance uh, which you can just do a search for online and you will be able to get the update but it's more recommended actually just to wait because that means then your machine according to microsoft is compatible then for the update so Windows 10 21H1 is now more widely available worldwide. I hope you found this video useful. Once again, thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.